So this video is about understanding your numbers. First of all, those numbers that are in your published accounts. Those are the outcomes in your financials in terms of that's how you're reporting your profit and loss account, your balance sheet to HMRC and Companies House, but they're only outcomes in your accounts. When we come to talk about understanding your numbers, also what are your success drivers? What is the activity and the key performance indicators that you have to deliver, you have to measure, that gives you the outcomes that you desire? So, for example, if you were to say, okay, my outcome is a certain revenue target, are there activity targets within that that then can help you to achieve that outcome without focusing on the outcome number? Because if you only focus on the outcome number and you achieve that or don't achieve that, you haven't really got a reflection in terms of what you can learn from. But if you can break down a revenue number, for example, into the number of people you sell to, the average sale value, and the number of times they buy from you, you've got something you can learn month by month, period by period, year on year. So it's important to decide on what your KPIs and your success drivers are, those things that I call your high payoff activities, those things that you have to do in your business for the benefit of your business without distraction. And for me, these are a mix of activity and output objectives. Additionally to that, once you've identified then, it's about keeping score, keeping a score by building out a scorecard in your business, maybe a maximum of 10 KPIs, but I'd recommend probably around four or five. And with this scorecard, you can keep a daily or a weekly track on your performance using a piece of paper or even an Excel, color the cells in your Excel so you can reflect and visualize your performance if you're a very visual person. And... If you are going to score, I always encourage you to score in a red or a green. Have you achieved or have you not achieved? Because avoid the grey scores, avoid the grey in your life, but keep your scorecard visible so that you know where your performance is aligning day by day, hour by hour, month by month, so that you don't get a shock and a surprise at the end of the period.